Okay, wow guys, great to see you again. Today we're gonna have another awesome giant surprise Jurassic World egg. This is gonna be a lot of fun. A lot of really cool dinosaur toys. But uh, before we do, uh, I've showed you these guys before. These are actually Mosasaurus uh, statues that were made for me by my uh, by uh, artist from Thailand so they are really cool uh, if you do want to check these out in really good detail uh, go to my uh, Jurassic World playlist I got it in there but anyways this is what it looks like and it's huge you can see from the size of my hand it's about twice the length of my hand super good detail paint job everything really cool and they come with these really cool water bases. And uh, uh, the thing is, I mean, I like this so much, I bought two of them. Because the Mosasaurus, uh, from what I'm reading, is going to play a really big part in the Jurassic World 2 movie. So they're going to have like a, a underwater scene with the Mosasaurus. So that will be totally awesome. But uh, anyways, the main reason we're here is to get some cool dinosaur toys from the giant surprise egg. Uh, let's go ahead first see what we have today and then we will open them up. Okay, the first thing we have is this pterodactyl transforming dinosaur egg. Cool. And then the next one was actually too big to fit into the egg. Uh, this is a cool Animal Planet set. This is the Dino Discovery. So you got some really cool dinos there. Uh, let's see if it gives some detail here. Okay, so you got the Dilophosaurus, the Ornitholestes, and the Baby Carnotaurus in this set. So there is if you want to read it for yourself. So let's see what else we got. Uh-oh, next one's cool. It's a little tiny one-step Transformers Grimlock. How cool is that? Awesome. So it's a one-step Transformer, but it's not the big one. It's a little tiny one. And then, of course, my favorite for these giant surprise eggs is this 15-pack of Jurassic World Miniature Dinosaurs. You can see this one's still sealed. Uh, like I said on some of my other surprise eggs, I actually bought, I think about 12 to 15 of these bags because they're so awesome. They come with different variants of the little Jurassic World Dinosaurs. And they have 15 surprise, like, blind bag dinosaurs in each bag. Cool. And then our next one is a Dino Trucks. This one is Dino Trucks Green Tyrox. <laughs> really cool. Uh, I do got a lot of Dino Trucks videos, guys. I mean, I reviewed pretty much all the Dino Trucks toys and play sets. So go ahead and check out my Dino Trucks playlist to see those. And then my next one, uh, this one is not, is actually not a new one, but one of my viewers wanted to see more herbivore dinosaurs. So it's a new one for me. This is a rubber, uh, Jurassic Park remote control Triceratops. So it's cool and we will take a closer look at it in one moment. Okay, so that is all the toys we're going to have today. Let's go ahead, unbox them, and check them out. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and remove our giant surprise egg so that we have more room for the toys. Okay, then our first one is going to be the one-step Grimlock because this guy looks awesome. Wow. Okay, let's go ahead and free him. Okay, so here we have our tiny little Grimlock toy. Uh, not really that much moving parts. So uh, this does lock here. You can see the head here comes together, but it doesn't, doesn't always stay together. <laughs> uh, let's see if I can push this. Okay, there we go. So once you push him securely together, he is in there pretty secure. And then uh, just go ahead, pull him here, 
His legs collapse. I mean, move to the side, turn into arms, and his head turns into legs, and the little Grimlock head pops up. Oops. Sorry. And the little Grimlock head pops up in the back there. So simply to transform him back, just go ahead, push this part forward. The legs will pop down. And then if you want to transform him, you pull these sides up. The arms pop out, the head pops up, the legs pop down, and you have Grimlock. Awesome. So uh, I did include Grimlock because he is a dinosaur. I mean, Grimlock is a T-Rex, so that's really cool. Okay, then our next one was the dinosaur transforming egg. Uh, these ones are, they're a little cheaply built. Uh, this, it did come from China, so this is more like a novelty type one. It's not the really good quality. Uh, if you watch my videos and you go to my uh, Godzilla playlist, I got some really cool Godzilla transforming eggs from Bandai, which are really good quality. But uh, anyways, this one, most of these are pretty straightforward, so you're gonna go ahead. Oh, see, like I said, uh, they do they do pop apart pretty easily. So go ahead, pop the legs down here, pop the leg here, pop the leg here. Inside you have a tail here, and you have a triceratops head. So, anyways gonna pop up the triceratops head pops out and you have a cool dinosaur transforming egg so like I said these are more of a novelty type item not the greatest quality but you know what it's still a lot of fun and then to transform him back simply fold this head down fold that uh, shield part down back there fold his tail in fold his legs up flip these down turn it up and you have a dinosaur egg awesome and then our next one was the green tyrox uh guys i have done i've opened about 30 of these uh die cast tyrox uh well 30 of the dino trucks die cast vehicles so these are really awesome uh dinosaur truck dinosaur toys cool so this is of course Tyrox but a green version so I mean I've never seen a green version in the show so uh, if you have seen it in the show make sure you leave it in the comment section down below uh, I've, I haven't watched too many episodes my kids really like dino trucks so I guess I should ask them. They should know better than me. And then you have uh, this little, the little ball here that swings back and forth, and he swivels back and forth, so it looks like he's getting ready to chop something. So awesome! And all these come with like little roller, little wheels on the bottom. So instead of rolling on the tread, they roll on wheels, but it looks like a tread. Cool. And then, of course, our next one was the Animal Planet set. So let me go ahead and free these dinos and we will check them out. Okay, cool. So anyways, let's go ahead and check these out. First of all, you have the biggest one, which is the Dilophosaurus. This one uh, does have an action feature. If you move his arms, the other one moves and it springs back. So I guess if you... up and have it uh, no so uh, this is it you know it's not the greatest quality this is a uh, inexpensive set but it is cool uh, they include like the huge frills on the side that are yellow and red really evil looking like green reptile eyes uh, big teeth huge claws on the arms but they do not paint the claws and the color scheme on this guy is blue and black, so... You know, it's a cool one. I mean, I like it. I, th I think it's, it's a lot of fun for an inexpensive set. And then you have 
of course, the baby Carnotaurus. Uh, if you checked out my Jurassic Park playlist, I got the big Carnotaurus ones on there. Uh, two of them, the Demon Carnotaurus and uh, another really big one with like a freaky looking mouth. I mean, he is really cool. But anyways, with the Carnotaurus, you got the three horns. Uh, a lot of times they'll call this guy like the demon dinosaur because he's got the big horns on the back almost gives it almost like a demon type look uh, teeth spikes on the back red blue and black color scheme so this guy is cool and then you got this guy that I cannot even pronounce let me try that again I think it's Arinthalestes so, Arinthalestes would be this one here. Uh, this one almost looks like a Velociraptor. He's got like a third claw here, and he's got like feathered arms and like feathers and spikes on his head. Really cool looking evil yellow eye. So, these are the three you get in the package. So, I think they're really cool. Uh, I like the Carnotaurus because I could put it with the other two Carnotauruses and make an awesome dinosaur family. So you could have like a mommy dinosaur, a daddy dinosaur, and the little baby Carnotaurus dinosaur. Cool. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, like I told you before, I really love these uh, 15 packs. And I'm gonna go ahead and cut this open for you guys. Uh, do not use scissors at home without your parents permission so i'm just gonna if i make a cut here i believe i could just yeah i could just go ahead and pull that off so uh, make sure you get your parents permission at home before you use scissors because they can be dangerous and then let's see if we have any color variants in here that i did not get before so these ones uh, a lot of them come with the uh, little triangle shapes here to protect them so I'm gonna go ahead free these guys and then we will check them out okay so I got them all freed uh guys once I do get all the packages opened I'm gonna have one video with all of them so I'll have over a hundred fifty of these little uh cool Jurassic World dinos and uh, I'm seeing one here which does not look like any I have got before. So this one is a Velociraptor, a dark green with like a brown color scheme. So this one is actually a new one, which is kind of cool. After opening so many packs, I'm still finding new color variants. I mean, I've, I've had to have opened almost 10 packs already, but these do include the third claw and everything. So that is cool. And then here you've got the Mosasaurus. This one, the color scheme is pretty much, I've seen different color schemes, but this is the one that's the most common, like the yellow, blue, black, and like grayish type color. The cool thing is all, is all of these are branded with the JW logo, so I really like that. And then a uh, cool green and like dark green and almost like a uh, lime green Triceratops. And this one, uh, that's a very common color also. And then two red Ankylosauruses, which that is very common too. I mean, I've gotten a lot of these packs with the two red Ankylosauruses, so kind of disappointing I mean you do get I've I've seen green ones too so you do get different color schemes oh this one actually has two mosasauruses which is unusual they are the same color schemes but to get two in a pack is very unusual I mean I have not got that yet and then you got a really cool spinosaurus which is brown and black I really like this color scheme. A lot of them are like a gold and I think green color. So uh, the brown and the black really does look a lot cooler. Big spine on the back. So Spinosaurus is actually one of my favorite dinosaurs. 
And then uh, this one's also a really common one that you get, the green Tyrannosaurus Rex. So this is a really common one for the T-Rex, little JW logo there. And then, oh, okay, so we I did get a brown variant Triceratops in this one too. So I am getting some pretty cool ones. Uh, a lot of times, like the different variants, you're only going to get one of each. But here I got the green variant and the brown variant for the Triceratops. And they do a great job uh, painting the eyes and the colors on these guys for smaller dinosaurs. Guys, I'll also put a link below the video where you could buy these 15 packs. Uh, Right now they're about $15, so you pay, are paying about a dollar a dinosaur, which is not bad for the uh, quality you get. They are small dinos, but they do a really great job painting them. So here you got a green and a brown uh, Allosaurus, which is, a, uh, I believe that's a new color variant too, because most of the guys I get for the Allosaurus are red. So that's cool. And then we have a uh, Dimorphodon here, which about every pack I believe I've gotten a Dimorphodon and a Pterodactyl. But uh, this is a very common color scheme also for the uh, Dimorphodon, like a gray, yellow, and a darker gray color. And then we got a uh, cool Stegosaurus, which is brown and gray color scheme. I've seen this one before in a few packages, but I really like the color scheme that brown and the gray go together. Really great. Uh, big spikes on his back. He's got the spikes for attacking on his tail. And then guys, this is a really cool color scheme for the Indominus Rex, because each one of these 15 packs is guaranteed to have one Indominus Rex and this is the color scheme I think I only seen this color scheme one time before uh, a lot of times it's a uh, different color so this is like a light gray dark blue with red eyes so they do a great job on the Indominus and then uh, the Pachycephalosaurus here this is a pretty common color for him also I've gotten this in uh, several different packages, but uh, I think for this guy, green is the most common color you're going to get for the Pachycephalosaurus. But uh, the brown and red color scheme is really nice. And then uh, the Pterodactyl, this is also a pretty usual color scheme for the Pterodactyl, like gray, and then they just put a tiny little splash of green on his head. So out of all of them, this one is probably the most boring. So there is the 15 of them. Like I said, once I get all my packs open, I'm going to put them together into a giant video. It would be really awesome. And then our last one. Like I said before, this is not a new one, but uh, due to popular demand, I will be trying to show more uh, herbivores which uh, thanks to my viewer was one of the ones that asked me for more herbivores. So I will try to include more of them. Now uh, this one has the uh, JP logo. He is all rubber. So I mean you could like squeeze this guy and do lots of fun stuff with him. Uh, here is like his speaker down here. The thing is with this one guys, I bought this one used and he doesn't walk anymore. So this one, it used to walk. He does make a sound though. Let's take a uh, listen. It's not the greatest, but if you push this left button here. So he, he sounds almost like he's like groaning. <laughs> and then this is the one that used to make him walk, but this guy is not walking anymore, so. Uh, I put in new batteries, so it's got nothing to do with the batteries. It's just, it's just an older toy. So, uh, but anyways, he is cool. 
to have like a Triceratops. You could have awesome battles with him and he's fun because his head smashes in. Check that out. <laughs> it's like crunch, crunch, crunch. So this one was a, a really inexpensive remote control one. So guys, that is all the toys that we have today. Uh, if you do like these videos, make sure you click like. Drop me comments, guys. Also, keep checking back, guys. Uh, pretty soon, I'm going to be uh, making a website. And I will have an email address for you guys, too. You can sign up for. And if you do sign up for that email address, then I will email you uh, a list of the upcoming videos for that week also uh once i get my website up i plan on having the upcoming videos for the week on my website so you could check out videos on there lots of fun stuff but uh it's probably gonna be about a month or so before i got that up and uh behind us i have some cool new jurassic world toys and besides the two Mosasaurus statues. So like I said, those were custom made by an artist. Guys, I love doing this. Uh, this is my job. I mean, I love my job. I love making these videos for you guys. Because uh, a lot of the toys I opened up, open up, a lot of my viewers can't afford it. So I love showing in detail what the toys are like. You know, the fun stuff you could do with them. So it's almost like you're buying the toy and playing with this. So if there's any toys you really want to see, go ahead and put it in the comment section down below. You guys are totally awesome, and I will see you tomorrow. Wow, guys, that was a lot of fun. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you click subscribe and the thumbs up button down below the video. And today's secret word is the word Go ahead and put that in the comment section down below the video. I'll know you're a member of my club. If you went to the video ends, there's an awesome end card. There's a lot more fun videos. And I will see you soon. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos. And if you want to see even more, go ahead and click the subscribe button.